Okay, welcome. Uh, my name is Chris Su. I'm with Delta. Today, I'm going to present the Delta Data Center Cooling Solution with all the teams, team members from Taiwan. So, um, you are looking at our uh, system level data center cooling product portfolio. From the uh, crate to the in-row cooler to immersion cooling and uh, the direct liquid cooling. Also, the, the rear door heat exchanger and the charging cart. We provide the full, full solutions for the data center cooling from everything. In this slide, you are looking at the illustration of every solutions we provide for data center. So that will fit into large scale, hyperscale, or medium to small size scale. In this slide, you will see where they are in the data center. That, that's the illustration. In the next session, I'm going to present the uh, Delta uh, air assisted uh, liquid cooling. If you're interested in this solution, you can go to our booth in the, in the OCP. And we do have an actual unit there. And uh, there will be our team members introduce, introducing this solution to you in very detail. So uh, the ALC cooling rack is a retrofit, ex retrofit solution of existing data center environment for the liquid cooling. And it's the answer to the growing AI needs. Because um, in recent AI, AI development, probably everybody knows that the power, the power of the chipset is growing in the exponentially, is growing exponentially. So, and, but um, however, for the data center there, uh, for the existing ones, you might have some uh, limitations. So for this solution, it doesn't require any raised floor and no facility water piping. And it's a uh, direct air cooling with fan wall or existing crack. And um, also, there might be some of the limitation of the capped rating of the power distribution. So that's the beauty of this solution. So you can reuse the existing data center infrastructure without spending a lot in the uh, infrastructure, but still fulfilling your AI needs. Okay. So in this slide, you see the pictures and of the, the actual unit in, in the data center. And also, you see the illustration. Our AALC cooling rack, in different configurations, it can cool one or two IT racks, depending on the manifold design. Here, in this slide, it's showing some of the key performance spec. And you might, uh, if you are needing the, uh, if you are needing the uh, very detailed spec, and Delta does have global footprint and global technical support, and you can talk to us anytime. And we can even custom design uh, on this solution for you. Also, um, we designed this AALC with modular and optional hot swap and redundancy features for the uh, high system reliability or the maintenance requirement, like the pumping module and the fan module and controller and filters. So those are easy replace, replaceable and maintainable. And also we have a very flexible system control and monitoring. And we, we offer optional HMI, the human uh, interface for the local maintenance, or you can, use, you can do the remote access with Mabas RTU or TCP IP or SNMP. And Delta was, well, Delta is known for its power, power module and power solutions. So in this AALC system, from this cooling rack to the IT rack, we offer from the mechanical part of the rack to the power, the power supply. And 
we cover everything in-house, so you get a uh, one-stop shopping experience on this ALC solutions. Okay. On top of the liquid-to-air solution like ALC, we also, we also uh, expand our product offering to the uh, liquid-to-liquid solutions. So next section, I'm going to introduce our uh, CDU, that's coolant distribution unit. Right now, uh, the largest uh, liquid-to-liquid CDU is at 1.5 megawatts. So here's the uh, key performance spec. And these are uh, in the uh, PVT stage, so we can do the sampling to you if you are interested in this CDU solution. Also, the charging cart. Um, data center folks, they, they are looking for like a solution which is user friendly, and it, well, while it's, it's good to have a very beautiful engineering design, but the ease of use is a key. So that is why we also offer the charging cart. Um, actually, last year, um, coupled with Meta, we have a uh, speech on this uh, charging cart, but this is our uh, standard offering, and we can custom design on the QDs and, uh, and even the uh, accessory kits. So this, um, so this function cart is, um, has three functions, like full filling or topping off, and also recharging in the data center. And also, if you, any, in any case, you need to drain any of the uh, liquid cooling system, it can fulfill that requirement. And uh, from the system level uh, of the CDU, and if we need to uh, distribute um, the liquid within or uh, within a rack or within a data center, we Delta offers those solutions. Um, so that's uh, next sections. We are going to introduce our rack manifold. So here is a typical uh, rack manifold design we offer to our customer. Um, it's not, well, coupled with our experience on the ORV3 rack, or ORV2, or other racks. So uh, we actually uh, designed and make uh, the manifold very robustly and also uh, it's, it's precisely. In terms of uh, precise, uh, precisely making, because um, the blind mate function is also important, so we took this example, uh, this manifold, uh, in rack manifold as an example, so you see that our flatness can be within 1.0. And this is our uh, Delta's manifold design capability in details, from the uh, even distribution, simulation, structural design, and everything. So we cover uh, everything, every design aspect in this manifold. Also, immersion cooling. So uh, we do have capability on both one phase and two-phase immersion cooling, depending on customer's need or other uh, considerations. Immersion cooling is a solution that minimizes the PUE and fulfill full-scale server cooling. Well, uh, full-scale full server cooling means that it will cool every spot in that server. So here is an example of uh, our single phase immersion cooling, and the coolant is um, the hydrocarbon. And that, that one, we already have um, production units. So if you are interested in this kind of a geometry or this uh, form factor, it's a ready solution. Also, we, Delta also offers the fluoride coolant solution. So if you see here, and you see the actual unit is running, and we, we've been shipping this uh, immersion uh, cooling tank to a very famous customer. 
And this is uh, our Delta's immersion cooling capability in details. So from simulation to, well, to the manufacturability from, from, um, from beginning to the end. Okay. Also, two-phase immersion cooling. And this solution is actually ready, but um, well, we do see some of the uh, reason make uh, the two-phase immersion cooling is slowing down, but however, uh, Delta does have this solution ready. So here, you see that uh, the actual unit is running. Okay. And also, I'm going to uh, introduce the uh, interface of the heat source, uh, the cold plate. Bear with me. My computers. <laughs> okay, it's back on. I guess it's not using Delta thermal solution. <laughs> yeah. It, yeah. Yeah. It just went black. It doesn't work. Okay, <laughs> it's working, yeah, by the help of my teammates. And that is, that is showing a perfect example of our global support and the team's support. <laughs> I'm speaking this from the bottom of my heart. <laughs> and the OCP folks, thanks. Okay. And so, um, Delta CoPlay solution, it's actually ready and very mature, so it's, um, it's not only um, mechanical and manufacturability, and we put a lot of RD resources into our co-play design, so uh, there are, well, we hold quite a few, quite a lot of the patterns, so, yeah. But um, we do custom design, and we do reference design with uh, key customers. Well, and air-cooled heat sinks, the, well, it's, our bread and butter, and we started from there, and we didn't forget it, but we make them better, okay? So um, here I'm showing the latest, uh, greatest technology we have here, and so, it, but it's mature, and it's being proven, and it's being uh, volume manufactured. So it's uh, enhanced uh, volume air cooling. So uh, this solution is using like heat path to move the, uh, to move the, uh, the energy to a better area, so that way you get uh, ex ex um, more volume for the air cooling, but uh, it's carefully designed. So the wattage, um, the QMAX, is, um, we can do right now is 650 watts. And also the uh, 3D vapor chamber, um, because of the power density, 3D vapor chamber, we do see the uh, growing demand on this one, and we are quite ready on this one. So we are uh, working with um, 
very large customers on this, this solution. So um, we are pretty confident in our design and manufacturability of the 3D vapor chamber. And smarter, greener, together. That's uh, Delta. That's Delta slogan. But every year I come to OCP, I feel like I'm smarter. And because we build the greener products, and I appreciate you spend time with me together and my team members. Thank you. <laughs> Any questions? For the inside, right? Okay. Uh, yeah, CC. This is CC, and he's the expert of our vapor chamber, and also, yeah. Okay. Hi, I'm CC. I'm from Delta Liquid Cooling Business Department. So right now, our standard cold plate, the liquid we are using inside the cold plate is by alcohol base, is a PG25. It's not the uh, water, it's a PG-25. Thank you. Thank you. One question only. Bad presentation. <laughs> okay, thank you everybody.